Tell the fucking irony of punching the Soviet Union with flour. G'day mates and welcome back to the Republic of Finland. Sadly we don't have Peter von Schmerd Schmerkel Ludwig Onk. Like Ludwig is a bit too German for that. Anyway. <laughs> Uh, but we now do have our lovely lads in the form of... Wait, why are we slightly not aligned? What is... Did we do this or... No? I thought we would... Oh, we just got zero communist... Oh, I guess when we got zero communist or fascist, it slowly made... Uh, it gave some of that to the non-aligned lads. Oh, well. We have our Nord... Is that... I think... Yeah, just... just I think it just says Norden. I was trying to read that last time. I had to get a little bit closer that time. I'm sorry if I just bumped the mark. Anyway, last time we left off, we were looking towards doing tanks and uh, mountain troops as well once we got the army experience, which is looking good. So let's start things off by developing our armies a little bit more. Okay, Viking warriors, done. House carls need to be uh, upgraded a little bit. Let's give them all they need. Good bit of arty. Well, they're proper bloody divisions now, aren't they? Berserkers can stay the way they are. Dragon regiments are also proper divisions. Good. Problem is the bloody manpower. We are about to get our new one though, and oh, the fall of Sevastopol. That's uh, German. Goddamn. Fuck, they, they're actually racing me to the bloody capital. Remember, I always remember Sevastopol because that was the uh, setting of the, what is it, Men at War game? The Red Tide one where you're fighting around Sevastopol and all that. Alright, let's see. Came along. Uh, Sven Sveeds. These lads? Okay, good. You guys are going to push for Moscow. We want it, we need it, bad. So, hang on. We'll wait till we form that up, good. And then all of Sven Sveeds. Gonna go for Moscow. Forget about here, we can, that's fine. Right, everyone's going for Moscow. Uh, we've got the Cult of Great Extremism. I'm just gonna get them to push a wide front. So here we go, we're gonna go from Minx all the way around to here, good. Oh, we'll kick these off, of course. Hang on, this one. What are you lads? Oh, you're the one standing on Germany's border. Um, and then you lads will leave for now until we close this little bit here. So hang on, we'll push in. God, this guy's actually holding off pretty- Oh, he's an NKV division. NKVD, rather. Um, let's grab ourselves. Hang on. <laughs> I beg my pardon. Um, here we go, grab these lads, and we'll get them pushing for Moscow as well. Yeah, we'll loop it here, just because I want to grab that little bit. Alright, there we go, lads. Oh, there we go, lads. We want to get rolling through here. There's actually more forces in the south. The uh, north looks pretty unguarded. But it's like Petrozavosk. Hang on. What the fuck are you... Where are you? Go. Go, you Nordic Union bastard. Alright. Oh, shit. Is it? Oh, no. I thought... God, I thought this fort was on that side. This is the bloody uh, naval docks problem where the docks always appear on the wrong bloody side of things. Oh, that's a bit weird. Hang on. Is it like... Is this like a dead end here? Have we caught a lad in a dead end? I think we have. Only me and you. Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> we fought alongside the Germans and helped them sunk some. Uh, help them sunk. Help them sink. Wait. I guess helped. Oh, the problem was I didn't put an ed on the help. <laughs> Jesus, I was wondering what the problem with that sentence was. I hit the wrong heart. The wrong part. Jesus. My uh. Like, look, I've been punching things today. Just my intelligence has naturally decreased. Uh, the more things I hit, it's uh, reverting to cavemanism. Oh, say it ain't so, you're even doing- <gasps> Who did a little surround? I guess this guy's surrounded too. Hey, two surrounds. Nice shit, let's keep pushing them. That's nice. There we go, yeah, dead lads. Good shit, good shit. Oh, this is open. Lads, uh, make, uh, the opportunity. Yo, oh, fucking hell. Germans have got a serious fight on their hands. I think I'm just pushing through. We're gonna swing around up here. You can divert and grab that. And try and grab their important bits in the north of the country. Uh, which, of- <laughs> I think it just consists of that, and that's about it. So... Yeah, okay, well, there we go, that's all we'll grab then. We're gonna train some more house carls, we'll train two more of them. Some more viking warriors, two more of them. And then we're gonna train some berserkers, which we don't actually have tanks for yet, I just wanna get them trained. So, yeah, we'll build tanks for them at some point. Uh, I wanna get the motorized side, uh, side of them trained. Actually, that's a good point, we'll start outfitting them. I swear, oh god, we can't even give them bloody light tanks yet, can we? But they'll just be five and five, right? That'll work. And then we'll give them all this shit. Here we go. Just means these guys will be trained with all the, with like half of their gear before we actually give it to them. 
Uh, before we give the tanks to them, rather. <laughs> or we can deploy them and do the whole thing I did in the uh, World War One mod, where I just had tank divisions with no tanks for some bloody reason. Oh, we've almost met the Germans. I think they're going to take MiGs before I can. Now, oh, well. Well, lads, I'd rather we focus on taking uh, Moscow, because that's my bloody goal. Oh, shite. Yeah, we're not going to break through here, are we? Yeah, they're pushing back on us. Okay, hold on, lads. Hold on. Hold the assaults. Hold the assaults. Hold bloody lot of ya. And you switch back to being regular. Good. Okay, hang on. I'm noticing this guy, however, could do with a little bit of a surround. Uh, we're not going to manage. All right, pull back, pull back, pull back. And instead, just attack him here. There we go. Good, just force him out. Shit, we're not even going to manage to push him out. All right, chill, lads. Chill, chill. Well then, these front lines are not going as great as I could have hoped, but uh, we're still pushing through eventually. Um, actually, yeah, you go here, you swing, you go there and swing that way. All right, hang on a second. Good shit. Oh, we are. Well, we're breaking through in the north though. God, there's. What if they just got worse troops up here or something? Because they're bloody collapsing. Okay, good shit. Oh, we have the Finnmark Brigade N. Oh, that. I assume that's boats there. Yeah, that was a... Oh, fuck, that was a carrier. Oh, fucking hell. No, please. No. Yeah, you can just try and walk for Moscow. Um, do we have any trucks in the north? I don't... Oh, no, of course, all their trucks are down here. Trying desperately to reach Moscow, as uh, as is their main goal in life. Go on. Go, 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 go. Moscovy. Uh, I think we can probably push this lad out. I, I don't like how we're getting surrounded here, so let's try and kill this lad now. I think he's still going to end up falling back, but at least we'll probably force these ones out. How are we doing? Oh my god, there's no one! Go, go, go! Uh, Sweden's, yes, go. There's no one on your line. Holy shit. Shake a bloody leg. Here we go. Yeah, this is... Oh my god, there's no one here either. Go, 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 go. I'm not going to send the order for these guys, though, because I think they're going to have some trouble in a moment. Okay, good shit. Alright, they're starting to meet lads that have been sent up to stop them, but we're still moving. Still moving. Good, good, good. Oh, I want to grab that bloody airfield. Actually, yeah. Bloody planes. How are we doing on these? Let's stick all of ours into here. Are we beating theirs? Nope. They've still got more than us. Uh, have we got any more to deploy? No, not really. We can deploy... Let's just deploy a wing of bloody 20 dive bombers. Who would we steal these from? Oh, probably like the other... No, it wasn't from the other nations. Was it? Oh, it might have been. might have been from, like, Sweden or somewhere that we got these from. Might be. Why did I put on naval bombing? What the fuck am I doing? What am I even thinking? No. Okay. Cool. There we go. I'll get to bomb some stuff now. Whoop. We've already lost a few planes thanks to our attempts to bomb things. Oh, shite. Well, actually, you know what we could do? We could set one of these lads to uh, close air support as well. There we go. Now uh, they might help out some. Good shit. All right, cool. How are we doing? Pushing through pretty well. We can just keep looping around them a little bit more. I kind of want to close this in. Uh, looking at the Germans in the south, I think they're stalling as well. The Russians have either deployed some new troops or something. Like, they're doing some pretty good shit here. Let's force this lad out. Good. Now you lot, attack this one here. Good. Yep, he's back. There we go. And you attack up here instead. Cool. All right, we're just pushing their lines slowly back. Well, the Germans have met us, but uh, I'd rather take Moscow first, lads. I want to see that delicious little message. Oh, can't use that just yet. Grab the uh, support weapons. Here we go. Quick, quick, quick. Go. Break through. Okay, push through here as well. Go. I am quite, like, this is a quite fun uh, match because it's not, I'm not incapable, but I'm also not overpowered. And what, what are these lads? Oh, bloody of course. Ah, oh, we're all repairing all this shit, but, uh, yeah, yeah, the bloody infrastructure's here is dog shit. Right proper. That's probably why half their troops aren't here. Oh, how do we lose Archangel? What? The fuck off. <laughs> okay. Keep marching. Okay, you've actually won, so I'm gonna let you push through here. Go, 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 go. Oh, shit. Hold it. Just park up here, lads. Park up here. Stop trying. Oh, you're not going to fucking win. Whatever. All right, who are these lads here? Cold of Great Extremism? Yeah, we're gonna... Oh, shit. <laughs> Can we kill him? <laughs> How did this happen? I didn't even notice. Um, How many have we got so far? 
6.4 to 300. Wow, we're actually losing more these days. I think because we've had a few pretty bad attacks. Uh, they've not gone great, that's for sure. But hey, this one's going pretty good. We're swinging into the uh, Soviet zone. Do we have, actually? We don't have, like, a... Ah, um... oh, we don't have the bloody get more non-core manpower. Aka, one of the best buddy, uh, bloody advisors. It's like, what was it? It's uh, a Prince of Terror? Gives you 2% more non-core bloody uh, population. Uh, manpower, that is, rather. And it's bloody strong when you uh, start conquering places like China and stuff. But it's actually... Because before it was a fucking useless one. It was just like, I think, partisans and something about national unity or something? I don't know. God, wasn't that great. National unity in this game seems to be either you have none of it or you have 90%. And it doesn't really matter one way or the other. Like, it's only really good if you're losing. That's why, for the most part, players don't give a shit about national unity. Alright, lads. Let's keep whacking on this. It's not actually even winter yet. We haven't even hit... I wish there was a way to tell what... Uh, like, what season it was. That'd be really, really nice. Uh, to know, like, invading in the winter or whatever. Because I don't know what it actually is. Because for me, October, that should be bloody summer, but... Europe, that's, like, not quite... Because if, if October, I guess, it's winter? Or is it not quite winter yet? Because December's winter for the United States. Or is it, wait, is it like a Northern Southern Hemisphere thing? Or is it a location? I think it's a location thing. Or is it a hemisphere? Like, is it... Because I'm Australia, right, do we have different seasons along the hemisphere? I, I'm not quite sure, I can't remember. Along along the equator, rather. Along our, uh... Our, it's, what, longitude... Fuck, which is longitude or latitude? Which is tall and wide? I can't bloody remember. Point is, I'm saying I'm not sure what actually causes seasons to be specific months. Um, but regardless, I don't know them, so it's kind of unhelpful. But you're like, hey, don't invade Soviet Union in the winter. When When is that? That would be nice to know. There's probably a button in the game. Uh, I don't think there is. I know this game slightly well enough to, uh, to take that stab and say it doesn't exist. I'm glad to see the Germans have stalled. Um, blood, oh, they have got a lot of troops down here. Right, tell you what. Nana's Norwegians. You're going to spread yourselves a little thinner. Actually, no, fuck it. You're going to draw up a new line. Just here. Literally just focusing on Moscow. There we go. Moscow. Moscovy. Oh, planes, no. Um, I should tell you what we can do. You lot push through here. Good, good, good. And that thins the front a little bit. Hello, Germany. Hello. There's an infantry type 9. Yay. That's nice. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Beauty. All right, there we go. So we keep rolling on here. Um, oh, here we go. Grab a little bit of this. What's this port just doing here? <laughs> what did this port bloody chip just doing here, rather? Military research. Lovely. Um, oh, okay, can we probably try and break through here? It's not going to happen, not going to happen, lads. Chill it. Just hold off. Um, I think we're going to probably pause the cult of great extremism, leave uh, the Swedes doing this, though. The lovely, lovely Swedish. The Swedish fish. And, uh, hmm. I don't like it, the putmen on the border again. Alright, lads, just halt the attack in general. Here we go. Yep, cool, cool, cool. Alright. Should hold things up. I want to join these borders, though, so I'm going to attack here and link our lads up. Oh, that's not working. Shit, they're sabotaging my crap. No! I'm using those! Get the fuck out! Oh, for fuck's sake, they, they retook the land. Well, at least we killed a division. 7k to uh, 360. Not going great, to be honest. Not going too great. We're losing a lot of men here. Fuck, we're down. We're down very heavily, uh, heavy on the man house, man house side, rather. I'm gonna cut out the berserkers. I'll leave these two. But honestly, we just need to like not have a war for a bit and just grow some bloody manpower. I think that's actually. Oh no, of course I've got. Oh, I've got road to 56 on. Of course I can use the. Hang on, where do my extended focuses go? Here they go. Oh, thank God I can use population growth. Whew, God, thank you, man. That's gonna help me out big time. Okay, just for now, Germany is also holding. We're going to have to wait till Germany assaults. Germany will, uh, Russia will pull off their units at the north. Go down and deal with Germany, and in that chance, I'll try and rush for Moscow. 
Uh, what do you even bloody want? Oh, I know what we want. I mean, I don't think I need it just yet. Let's let's hold off and let's get a bit more industry, shall we? Good stuff. What am I bloody? Oh, what am I bloody doing? God, dumb, so fucking dumb. I'm meant to build tanks, aren't I? Yeah, well, I guess I'm not building the berserkers anymore. I still should build tanks. They're a bit bloody helpful. Although I suppose I should swing for like medium or uh, heavy. How late are we? We're 1940. I should swing for medium tanks because uh, light tanks start to go out of use around about here. Heavy wouldn't be too bad if it's just breaking through though, so... I don't know, we'll see. I'll have a quick peek. I think I just want to... Because I can produce... Actually, I'm, you know what? I'm going to go heavy. Just because I can produce them, I just don't have the manpower for it, so I want to run m less heavy divisions rather than uh, all the way around. Let's... Do you want to get another army regrouping or do you want to get some air support, lads? Let's get... Let's get air uh, superiority. Plus 10%, good. That should give us a nice little bonus when we're fighting in the air. I'm oh, sorry, not when we're fighting in the air, whether when we win the air war. Germany, are you attacking again? No, because they're pulling troops off the line. Alright, time to snipe the provinces, as as is a uh, tradition. Go on then. Slowly. Slowly. Good stuff. Okay, cool. Oh shit, they've got no one here. Where have all... They can't have gone. Alright, lads. Uh, hang on. Nana's Norwegians. There you go. Go, lads, go. Ooh, ooh. Beautiful. Cool. Start claiming a bit of land here and there and everywhere. Hang a second. Try and cut off these lads if we can. Nice little pocket here. Are we attacking with them? Yeah, we can too. Beauty. Alright, you guys are pushing through. We'll swing down and meet the Germans here. Smolensk. We'll try, I'm actually just going to try and like steal as much territory from the edge of the Germany border as possible. Oh, the Germans have kicked up again. I think the Russians have noticed what I've done as well, but let's quickly finish these lads off. Just a bunch of bloody horses. And they mocked the Polish for using horses. Fun fact, the whole... The Polish charged the Germans with friggin' uh, lances didn't actually happen. The Polish were charging the Germans with lances, indeed. And it was working very well. And then armoured cars turned up. And so they stopped doing that and left because you can't charge an armoured car and they're not that fucking dumb. But, you know, let's mock Poland a little bit more. Um, yeah, I guess let's do this. I'm always... These always piss me off. Like, I'm looking... Max planning, plus 20. Awesome. Overwhelming fire. Don't know what that does. Don't know how effective that is. Like, I never know how good these tactics are that I'm always, like, researching. It's like the last one in the gorilla tree just gives you a, a tactic. That's it. I'm like, this tactic looks cool, but I can't choose it. I can't tell my generals to trend towards it. I just have to sort of hope they use it. Does it matter? Is it going to be really that much better than just attack? Really? Will it? Because they all, like, come with negatives. I, I mean, it probably is overall, but I don't fucking know because the game doesn't tell you this. Oh, well. Okay, we're almost there. Pushing through. Oh, fuck! No! No, 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 no. This is not how this game goes. No, 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 no. So they were actually defending the German border then. Well, time to uh, push a little bit more into their lands. Here we go. Beautiful. Oh, hello. I love when we just randomly surround them. We're just like, oh, hey, we got some new lads to murder. It's good. It's good stuff, it is. Okay, keep pushing in. We've got this fair and bloody square. Fun military research. Now the question is, do we go for importing artillery? Now I like this. Oh, now uh, we do have to go down this line at least one of them because at the end is recruitable population factor, which is massive. Um, ski troops is not. Oh, that's not that nice. It's actually only one research bonus for any three of them. So. Maybe we skip out on this stuff. Yeah, I think we skip out on that. Finnish Navy's not too bad, because you can get a production bonus either way, but we don't really need a Navy yet. This is nice to get down to fund VL. But I think... I think what we're going to do is we're going to go... Recruit strategists, I guess? Or do we import... Anti-tank, anti-tank... I mean, we're about to get to the anti-tank level of techs, so we might as well get these, I guess? Yeah. And then we'll get Mobilize Lotta Svard. 
Oh, it's by the oh the women and the lotters lotters I don't know what that means. Sure, let's do this. Motivize the women. Mot motivize? Yes, indeed. Motivize. What does that mean? Um, have we got? We don't have naval bloody invasion text. That's gonna. That always comes to bite me in the ass late game. Where I'm like, oh, I never researched naval invasion. Let's just sit here for a bit while this happens. Um, God, I love the fur line. Let's get our tanks done. We'll get some heavy tanks that when we do take on Germany, we can uh, bash right through. So a big part of this is going to be the fact that the Entente fought them and not the Allies means I can take all of Europe apart from the Benelux region. Uh, because they won't join the Allies. Oh shit, never mind, the Metamorsia are here. Of course, I'll have to worry about them. Oh, they're in their own faction, so I can kill them too. In fact, I might just kill the Metamorsia next. That's in probably the most logical stance, but I can't justify War Golan in him. Shite. Wait. Wait, what? Lithuania has war goals against Poland? Because they stole Willow? No, okay. Um, but I can't really... I, can, I guess I could go for Benelux because they're their own faction. I'm just afraid of somehow them joining the Allies or something, but I could take them on. I'd need to navally invade them, though. So, oh well, we'll see. And I couldn't take on Luxembourg because they'd probably join the Allies. Alright, hold off, lads. Pull up. We're getting close. We're on the bloody outskirts. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, march in there. Finish that off. You, you lads be careful now. Careful. Okay, pull back, pull back. Okay, we want to just watch the line. Watch for any uh, weak points like here. Hang on a second. Good stuff. Okay, pushing through. Anywhere that's not got a bloody river guarding it, we should bloody well attack. Here we go. Good stuff. Alright, pushing through. Uh, where do we want to go? I don't, I'm not really worried about the north. There's nothing good up there. So, like, once we've got Archangel, that's pretty much it. I mean, that only gave us one bloody uh, Civi factory as well. So, never bloody mind. Actually, that's what we can do, is we can uh, knock up the Soviet Union to harsh. But it gives us less manpower, but... Eh. I mean, we're, we're occupying them at the moment, not colonies, so let's just bump it up to harsh. Yeah, we lost a little bit, but we get a, bit, a few more factories. Oh shit, my fighters haven't been building for a while. Ah, oh, my fighters are all the bloody broken ones, crap. Oh well. Sport weapons, what do we want next? Can't get that yet, can't get that yet. Could get this, I want to get it just because it gives 100% uh, hardness. These motorized units, they were 100% hard. Hmm, Metal Gear. <laughs> Metal Gear. I just, I just fucking love anything from Metal Gear. Any and all the quotes. And also, uh, Kaz's speech. Is it, his name's Kaz, isn't he? Fuck, I, I played the shit out of Metal Gear Solid Five, and... That game doesn't have an ending. It just doesn't. It's fucking awesome. It doesn't, though. Also, depending on how you play it, you get a completely different game. If you play full-blown stealthy, your game is way different. And also, giant super mecha robots. That's pretty cool, too. Well, I mean, they are, after all, the Metal Gears. Oh, shit, it's happening! Yep, there we go. <laughs> I almost didn't catch it. Wait, you're, you're fucking kidding me, right? No? N no, no? There's no Finnish message for taking the mosque. Okay. No, 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 no. I, I see how it is. You know what? You can just fuck me like that and get away with it, apparently. It's what, it's what you think. Uh, okay. Well, that's, um, really just, uh... Yeah, you know, it's not, not making me feel great as a person, you know? I'm just, uh, checking something here real quick. Okay, weird, okay. Never fucking mind. Um, okay, you know what? Let's, uh, let's just capitulate the Soviet Union anyway, because I'm sick of this shit now. I'm sick of this shit. I am. I am, I am. Thank God they only need 50 bloody, uh, percent, or else we'd be right screwed. Get some speeds in here. We'll get our planning way up. In fact, most of the speeds are done. Um, we can knock out the boats. Put a few more into planes. A bit more into Artie. It's all good and done. Good stuff, okay. One more here. There we go. Um, right. Oh, hello. These lads are cut off. 
Well, let's try and grab a little bit more land. We will probably want to swing for what? These five victory points here, ten here. Yeah, these should knock them out of the race. And uh, three down here. Stalingrad hasn't fallen yet. But maybe we can make him capitulate without needing Stalingrad. So, how are we doing on the whole planning side of things? Planning's good, planning's good, planning's good. Okay, so... Uh, we don't, we don't want to delete everything. We just want to delete... Oh, Nana's Norwegians? Good. Okay, delete that. So we grab the whole bloody lot of them. And we're going to get you guys to go to here. Sure, we'll try and break through and push down for Stalingrad. And then we'll pull this bloody uh, line around. There we go. To Moscow. And there we go. Okay, cool. So we'll let everyone get set up real quick. Hey, more of these lads. Uh, we'll put these ones in Nana's Norwegians. No, we'll put them in Cold of Great Extremism. There we go. Okay, cool. So everyone should be ready. Cold of Great Extremism looks great. So I think we are go. Let's see what happens. I'm going to put you lads on aggressive. 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 Let's get rolling. I'm going to try and nab as much land as, uh, as quickly as possible and get... Uh, that advantage in the peace deal over good old Mr. Hitler. What do we want? Oh yeah, we want to do this. Branch into operation. Yay! Uh, what else do we want? I already got that. I'm not really sure I want to... I guess I could roll down the research line, get a bit more research done. It's okay. It's not the best, though. Hmm. I mean, honestly, I'm not too fast about this line. Let's look into more useful lines. We're already getting our tanks. Uh, we need to f definitely need to look into more... Oh, shit, I know what we need to get. What am I bloody doing? We need to get Mountaineers. Of course we do. What am I doing? What am I bloody doing? Let's get these boys. We'll get our Mountaineers, and then next we'll start going down the uh, support arty tree. Get those done. So I have some tanks, support arty, Mountaineers. Good stuff. Basically, I want all my troops to be Mountaineers, because... Uh, if we and we might get some marines at some point, but I don't think I want this most to be a land war. Basically, that's what I want to deal with. Why are we researching T-35s? Wait, do we just have the Soviet tree? I think we do. We've got. I think that's a German tank to start with. No, that's the French tank. No Austria. No, okay, that's the German one. Yeah, but it looks like the French one. I guess. Huh. Okay. Anyway, uh, and then it just goes down the bloody Soviet tree for some weird reason. Oh well. Okay, we're pushing through pretty bloody well here. Let's swing around. Plane-wise, oh, we're into bloody uh, Central Russia. Okay, let's shift our planes then. And we want to capture this. Lads, can anyone actually... Okay, you see that? I want the airfield. Go on. Go on, chief bloody objective. Yep, there we go. Airfield's going to be mine. Beautiful. How big is it? 400 planes. Well, thank God I don't have more than that. I have 400. Well, I wish I had 400, brother. Don't even have that. British 17 pounders. Let's, uh. Oh shit! We lost Moscow! What is this? Nope! Recapture it! What the fuck was. <laughs> British men, are you okay? That was a lot of shouting. Uh, Molotov cocktails, yay! They're so neat. I love Molotov cocktails. They just work by burning a tank out, overheating it, and then uh, melting through it. It's quite nice. Well, not melting through it really, but bloody uh, burning through it, I guess. And. A tank that doesn't fucking work. Can't do shit. The Finnish in the Winter War were amazing. Such a, uh... Such a cool little war. You don't actually... I, well, I, I, I never heard much about it when we're talking about World War II. World War II always seems to basically go... Germany invaded Poland. Blank. Then France got knocked out. Blank. Then D-Day. Oh, I, I guess. They do touch on Barbarossa. But it's, uh... We mostly learnt just straight to D-Day sort of thing. Um... And one of those things that always lasts, fucking gets me laughing is um, all the world, or like all the documentaries and stuff that always start in 1941. You know, they open World War II with Pearl Harbor because that's when World War II started, didn't you know? With America entering it. Then it truly became worldwide as if it wasn't fucking worldwide beforehand. Yarda, yarda, yarda. Hey, enough of my salt mines. Although, I had some chips earlier and they were fucking delicious. Put some good chicken salt on them. Actually, finally had something to put chicken salt on. I've been trying to put my chicken salt on everything. And chicken salt is one of those things that goes on very few objects, but when it goes on them, it's pretty good. You can't just put it on everything, like sauce. And I've been trying, and it just doesn't fucking work. Alright? Anyway, enough about chicken salt. Um, what do we bloody want? We're not fussed about that, not fussed about that. 
Most of these I'm not too fussed about. We maybe get tank designer? I guess since we're doing tank research, yeah. Let's get bloody tank designer and then arty designer. And then we'll go and get uh, traditional... Oh, what is it? No, total equality. So, tank designer first. Lovely, lovely. Especially since we're going uh, heavy tanks. A bit more armor would be nice. Come on, we've got Moscow now, don't we? Hang on. Yep, there we go. Good. Pushing in. How are they doing? Oh, 97% of the way there. We won't even have to grab Stalingrad, I don't think. This is all thanks to Trotsky. Shouldn't have taken over, should ya? I think grab Gorky. Gorky! And we'll uh, be right good. Berserkers, they're fine. Dragon Regiment, they're fine. Oh! Concentrated industry? Why, that's puck positively amazing! Let's grab a bit more Malaya. A bit, a bit more of Malaya. She's a fine, lovely lass. Um, God, come on, Soviet Union. Collapse in this round, would ya? You're right, pricks. I do quite enjoy it was my trucks that got in there first, though. Christ. Here we go. Just gotta go. Oh, fuck, an A. The Soviets have pulled the thing on me, but never mind. We're apparently, currently, my guy's more concerned with capturing Dula. Uh, can you just drive through and actually save our lads, please? This is not great. Oh, you can save yourself. Oh, never fucking mind. Okay, you hold off too. We might actually have some lads in trouble here. What's this worth? Oh, worth three. Okay, but it's not going to end the war, is it? Is it? Because if so, he might actually end the war back. No, 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 no. It's not 1%. Hardly. Okay, pushing in here. Go, boys, go, boys, go. Come on, we just got to take that bloody tank division out. You swing in here. Wait for it. Okay. Oh, what are you doing? Oh. <laughs> you know, I do like how my troops normally when they get surrounded, you know, get concerned for their lives and maybe, you know, worry about losing their food supply. This guy just decides to go and keep conquering. Ah, <laughs> oh, they have us surrounded. Good. We'll hit them no matter where we aim. Fucking hell. Um, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Feeding the troops again. I think we're yet to lose a troop to Soviet uh, encirclement, which makes me quite proud of myself. Start building some armoured cars. They're not actually armoured cars. They're my light fucking tanks. Why did you send... Hang on, what is this? Also, game frozen, why? Oh, that's why. No fucking way. Hang on. You did... You fucking... You glorious bastard. It was Tula that changed the war. I doubted him. I doubted my hero. <laughs> But he did it anyway! Okay. So we got a fuck ton of tanks, fuck ton of rifle, fuck ton of... Oh god. The Soviet Union has capitulated. This is a great victory for the Nordic Union. So why did they send a heavy cruiser and a destroyer? Just... just into an entire fleet of heavy cruisers? Sure. What's this? Let's see. I do like seeing the disc. Damaged 100% of the Leningrad and then fucked off. Wait, was that the... Oh, that was actually the uh, German one, yeah. It was given away by its German name, funnily enough. So, I just, for a brief moment, let's just... Mmm. 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 That's beautiful. That is lovely. Now let's do the peace deal. I'm sorry, we have to interrupt everything to say this. Stalingrad? <laughs> Stalingrad. <laughs> it's a one-tile province that's just a bunch of fucking mountains that you can't pass, and it's called Stalinabad. <laughs> oh, that's great. I don't know if it exists in real life, but I'm so fucking happy. I did a thing today. No, I'm not sorry I did the thing, but I did it. I should have claimed all of Siberia before Japan could. I'm a fucking idiot. The Nordic Union took 73 states, the German Reich took 40. Italy took three, Japan took 15, which you can quite clearly see. The Soviet Union was annexed. The Iraqi People's Republic was annexed. 80,000 equipment was seized. Now, importantly, oh, these guys are actually left alone and as such haven't made alliances or anything. Oh, never mind. No, okay, so you're not anything, you're not anything. But Tanutuva is in the common turn, which is a little funky. 
and Mongolia. So, wait, where's, okay, Mongolia's here. So I'm just gonna invade these. Yep, okay. I have a truce till when? Till June of this year. Let's invade. Oh god, it's gonna take me 10 days. Alright, I'll actually wait until the truce runs out then, because I might actually not have enough time to uh, declare the war. But, overall, situation has improved. Also, we've built a fuck ton of just shitty tanks. These aren't even my, like, real tanks yet. Uh, naval battle. Oh, oh, hang on. Why did we fight against... Why was... This is weird. So the Soviets and the British fought against the Germans and the Nordic in the same battle, but we're not at war with... What the fuck just happened here? Okay. But hey, we're not at war with anyone. So there we go. So, we lost a little bit of land around here. Small, small But, uh... Overall, pretty fucking good. Can't declare war on these lands. No. Oh, and also... Oh, yeah, I thought they were protected. No. I wish we could. I wish we could declare war on them. They need to just create some sort of world tension, and then we could, uh, go for a little world war. Oh, shit! Germany's at war with the Allies, really? How did this happen? War on the Republic of China? Did you join the fucking Allies? Oh, no, no, no. Okay, so they would have joined their war. Uh... Like protection or something? I don't know, something that would have been like to persuade the British or whatever. Holy shit, that's actually really cool. So there's like a Chinese joint front and allies war. That's neat as neat. But, for now, I'm gonna focus on other things. Let's finish off the common turn and uh, get done. So, what do you want to do? Oh shit, Greece submits. Turns into a Greece puppet. Oh, a Greece puppet. Ah yes, my favorite kind of Greece puppet. Just after the sock puppet. Um, come on, you bastard. Do, do, May, June, July. Good, it's the right month I'm thinking of. Go. Cool. Um, shit, you are. Well, that's not that great, but... Oh, shit, you're the Saddleback. Yup, 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 we're declaring war on you, too. You haven't made any fucking world tension. God damn it. I was going to say we could take you out without anyone worrying, but, uh... Oh, for fuck's sake, this sea has ruined me again. I was going to build, like, oh, port on both sides, but you can't. So these divisions here are actually kind of fucked for a long time. All right. You lads, Cult of Great Extremism, can go deal with the uh, remnants of the common turn. Here we go. Cool. Off you go. Nana's Norwegians, you lads can prep yourselves at what border? Should... God, they're getting fucked up in the, uh, in the Africa. In the Africa, yes, of course. Then, yeah, let's just go sit in this border, and in the event of a war, you guys can rush in here. And then the Swedes can guard the border with the Metamorsi. I wish you'd always... You can't do faction borders before a war is declared, and that really annoys me. See, like, I can't do a border along these two, despite the fact they're in the same faction. And they, uh, should be able to. Almost a motta, uh, what's it called? Mobilized motta, lotta, water, wato. Eh, wato! <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Alright, lads, come on. Grab all our aircraft up, hold all of ya, and we're sending you home to Finland. There we go. The wind in my hair. Hey, Tenotuva! Can we declare war yet? No? A few more days. God, that was, that was a really fun war, actually. I do like how this war goal, like, I, I played the peace game here. I wanted to keep all the good resource states, all the high military states, and all the contact with other nations I could then later invade states. And I think I did that pretty fucking well. So, uh, there we go. Declare our war. Our lads aren't there yet, but they'll be there soon enough. Land wars in Asia, suck dick. What is New Zealand? What are you doing here? That is New Zealand, because it's the, uh, it's the Red Stars. It's our Red Brother. Hang on a second. There we go. There we go. Full of Hong Kong? Oh, shit! New Hong Kong. Siamese Empire's- Oh, shit, of course, the Siamese Empire was a thing, wasn't it? <laughs> Not anymore. Oh, the French state? Of course, they were fascist as well, my god! And there's the Empire of Vi I forgot there's the whole, like, fascist area. God, Yunnan is still around this late into the game. Oh my god. What a world. What a fucking world. 
Oh shit, yeah, no, Australia's getting invaded. All these islands are fallen to the Japanese. Philippines still holds out. There's a lot of cool shit going on here. Alright, let's run a bit more of these lads. A bit more military stuff, a bit more civvy. Work the place up. Good stuff, okay. We're all fairly well equipped. I think... Hmm. Yeah, I think really, once we've taken on, uh... Tanu Tuva, uh, I think we'll really be stuck for choice until we either Turkey makes some uh, bloody national world world tension. That's what I was looking for, or one of these do. Maybe if we stage a coup in their lands, will that cause world tension to be created for any reason? I'm gonna try it and just see what happens. Yeah, fascist coup. We good? We good? All right, and. Uh, Make sure we equip that first. I just want to see if, like, like maybe volunteers or something, like something they do, will hopefully cause them to, uh, what's it called? Suffer some world tension. Just bloody anything. All right, tell you what, are we almost done here? Oh, we're not fucking take. How have we not taken ten over yet? Fix this shit, brother. All right, let's get our support artillery. There we go. Ulaanbaatar. I remember this place from when I was playing Mongolia. Good old lads. Oh, wait. Wait, they haven't joined the war. What? Oh, no. They have. Oh, they have. Okay, good. Right. Why do they not look... Because that's from Iran. That's why it looks weird. Okay. I was wondering why there was this p person who wasn't at war with me. Go, lads. Go on. Shh. Dance the night away. God, good song, this. All right. Let's also uh, improve our frontline infrastructure a little bit. Just along all these parts, just for when the inevitable war breaks out. Good shit. The thing that sucks about a supply, right, is that we have to send it all the way around here instead of just boating it across. Oh shit! Poland refuses German ultimatum. Tentative is gone. Hang on a second. Fuck. Still can't. Poland's de uh, Germany, uh, Germany has declared war on Poland. What's it, like 1941 and that's just happened? Okay, here we go. Nom, nom. Do we maybe want to take Mongolia? Okay, let's have a quick look at Mongolia. Do we want to take the population instead? Uh, it doesn't give us the population here, but... I mean, seven factory factories isn't anything to scoff at. Dance. Oh, fuck it. Whatever. We're not going to bloody build puppet troops. Fuck this shit. Done. Nice. We've got a little extension. Good shit, lads. Oh, shit. We have lost two troops. Oh, my God. We've lost troops to just not having enough men. Here, I was thinking we're doing bloody fine. Yeah, but I think Poland's right fucked because they're surrounded, but uh, we'll see. I might dive in and give them a hand because Zogsmith's deadly. Fucking it. Everyone's... Ha if someone had resisted, maybe... We could have done a lot better, but uh, I think as is, I might still try to uh, to resist the Germans and actually invade them. Because if I do, and I succeed, I'll... Uh, I don't know, they're actually doing okay. The Metal Wars aren't doing terribly. They're not doing great, but they're not doing... Ah, oh, the fucking Hungary is going to push in as well. Look, we'll decide this all next time, but till then, I've been Remy. This has been the Republic of Finland as the Nordic Union. And hey, we're about to finally get some bloody manpower again. Oh my god, what a game. This is really good fun, actually. I'm in a more powerful position. Still got no manpower. We're going to have to fix that problem, sure as sure. Till next time, everyone. Farewell. Farewell.